Thank you, Chris. And with winter weather on the way, road commissions and utility companies are preparing for whatever Mother Nature has in store for us. TV5's James Felton joins us live in the studio to tell us how they're getting ready. James. Meg, I spoke with a representative from MDOT, the Midland County Road Commission, and Consumers Energy, who all say they're ready for our latest round of winter weather. They're kind of excited, to be honest with you. <laughs> this is this is what we do, and it has definitely been a slow uh, slow winter so far. Art Buck, General Superintendent at the Midland County Road Commission, says his crews are eagerly awaiting their task of keeping the roads clear once the snow arrives. We've got all our trucks loaded up right now with salt and ready to go. Um, they've been in, in the shop getting anything fixed that needed to be fixed, uh, getting wing plows put on. Same thing goes for the Michigan Department of Transportation Bay Region. Jason Garza is the Associate Engineer for Operations. We'll have crews out um, kind of monitoring conditions and blading snow and applying salt uh, as needed to get us through the storm. And for those planning to move snow on their own, Garza wants them to put it in the right place. If um, people can be conscientious of not pushing snow from their driveways into the travelway and roadways uh, that creates a very serious safety hazard and so uh, and it creates additional work for if it's either MDOT crews or county crews or even the local municipalities um, that's something that um, that we, we would like to avoid. Over at Consumers Energy spokesperson Tracy Wimmer says they've been watching this storm for the past week. The biggest of course is high winds. Um, High winds have a large impact, not necessarily on our lines themselves, but often on dead trees and tree branches. That could fall and take down lines. Wimmer wants customers to know that consumers' energy is confident. Any power loss will be restored quickly. A lot of it is just about preparing for the possibility of losing power for, you know, a, a brief period, if at all. Getting back to Buck, he wants drivers to give the plows room to groom. If the roads are cruddy, then just stay home, you know, if you can. Uh, if you got to go out, take it slow. Uh, if you see our trucks, give them room. You know, these guys got a job to do. They're trying to clean the roads up for you. So just uh, give, give, them the, give them the room and the respect that they need. And Consumers Energy says now is the time to make sure your batteries, you have batteries for flashlights and keep those electronic devices charged up and also have a plan to keep perishable items refrigerated.